As part of Project Thanksgiving, this is one of our success stories, the story of the well. This is the type of faith I think every one of us should strive for in our walk with Christ. Our family 17 had already been a huge success, using the money they earned from studying out their male pig to purchase their own land. But they took it a step further. They decided that they would dig a well by hand, bucketing the dirt out bucket by plastic bucket in the 90 degree plus heat going deep into a dark hole. Remember, you should ask Bob about the spiders. Until they hit, finally hit water. They actually used a handmade ladder. One of the neatest stories, uh, we found the family that, um, a lot of, there's a lot of sickness there because you know, there, there's just not enough fresh water and there are not enough wells and the wells are so far apart, those that they have. But Now here's the faith part. If we or someone else did not provide the $700 plus dollars to purchase the brick, this well would cave in when the rains came and all that work would be useless. But they relied on a loving God that they deserved and needed clean drinking water, which they agreed to share with surrounding families. Looking down into the well, it's deep. It's, it's so much deeper, I couldn't see the bottom. I can't imagine that two people alone could uh, do this type of digging and make this, this very professionally done well, but I'm sure it served them because um, so much of the disease and the problems down there have to do with the lack of fresh water. Uh... Well, I asked the elders of the church we had been attending for a while if they could release the money for the bricks. They prayed and God provided a thousand dollars to purchase bricks and whatever else was needed for the well to be completed. Just this past January, Dad and I got to see a beautiful, constructed, fully functioning well where they drew up clean water even long after the rainy season.